Welcome to another video in the Total Virus Safety Series on virus testing for biological products. In our previous videos, we talked about various ways to prevent viral contamination, along with virus removal and inactivation techniques. In this video, you will hear about additional ways to ensure viral safety for monoclonal antibodies and meet regulatory expectations. In order to verify viral safety, regulatory agencies require testing of the master, working, and into production cell banks, as well as testing raw materials used in the production process. Regulations also require testing of in-process intermediates and final product. As with viral clearance studies, these tests require specialized equipment, plus reagents and the expertise in labs that deal with infectious viruses. Outsourcing these activities to a specialist in these areas can be a cost-effective and efficient solution. Cell bank testing involves verifying the identity and purity of the banks. Identity testing requires that the species of the cell line be confirmed. For purity testing, the cell bank must be confirmed free of adventitious microorganisms, such as bacteria, fungi, and mycoplasma, as well as viruses. Demonstrating the absence of adventitious viruses involves a number of both in vitro and in vivo assays designed to detect a wide variety of viruses, including viruses associated with specific species. Several assays are also available to detect retroviruses. Specific viral contaminants, such as murine minute virus, MMV, or bovine polyomavirus, are detected using qPCR assays. Although the master cell bank must be extensively characterized, less testing is required for the working cell bank and the end of production cells. Process intermediates, such as the bulk harvest, must also be routinely tested for microbial or viral contamination. Viral contamination testing requires both assays with broad specificity and assays for specific viral contaminants. Testing also includes quantitation of endogenous retroviral-like particles found in bulk harvests from CHO cells. When animal-derived materials must be included in a manufacturing process, testing for adventitious viruses is critical. Testing is targeted to detect viruses associated with the species of origin for the raw material. Assays for specific viruses, as well as assays with broad specificity, are used. Regulatory agencies require substantial testing to ensure the viral safety of a monoclonal antibody product. This testing can seem complicated and confusing, so using a contract service laboratory that specializes in viral safety testing can help you navigate the regulatory requirements and design a testing program that's appropriate for your product. Thank you for watching this video on testing for virus safety. Please be sure to review other videos in this series for additional insights.